This is the weirdest shoot I've ever done in my life. I'm literally just sitting there taking photos on my phone. I'm like, yeah, that's great. That's great. Like sitting in my pajamas at home. Oh my God. Okay, I'm sorry. I need to like scream at my dad. I, no, mm, may, yes. Mm, no, no. Do you know what? <sighs> Questionable quality still, but. Seriously, I feel like a creepy dad. I'm just like, yeah, yeah. Hello everybody, welcome back to my humble abode here in Ireland. Today we are going to be doing something highly unusual that I never expected to be filming in my life. But I also didn't expect to be living back at home at the tender age of 28, so what do you know? Uh, today I'm going to be doing a FaceTime photo shoot and I've been fighting it for a long time. I've seen people doing it and I just, I don't know, it's just... You know, the quality isn't great. You know, you get grainy image. It's just mm, questionable, but you have to be creative, you know? So today I'm going to be working with Deja. You guys have seen her in one of my LA photo shoots that I did. I kind of told her what kind of styling I want, gave her some ideas. I don't know what her apartment looks like. I know she has some backdrops. I kind of have an idea of what styling she has, but that's about it. Okay, so before we get into this video, please make sure to subscribe to my channel and click the little bell button to not miss any of my future uploads. And let's get right into the FaceTime photo shoot. I should be sitting in my pajamas. Why don't I have my pajamas? Better. <laughs> Um, so I'm going to be taking photos on my camera of the screen. It might just help the quality of the images be a tiny bit higher. It's going to help me with the editing afterwards because there's going to be just a tiny bit more detail rather than just taking a screenshot of the thing. So I'm basically just taking a photo of my phone. Okay, so my phone is here. I'll be... Can we push you or the phone just back a tiny bit? Because I'm just like very close to you and my, my face is like very close to you. So I think the biggest issue for me now is that I'm in the corner of the screen, which is kind of slightly annoying, but... Okay, that's nice, but I'm in the corner. Ah, questionable quality still, but... Actually, do you know, I have a lens. I have a macro lens in my... Um... Oh, I need to move my desk. Ah, oh, because I, I have a macro lens and it's going to be able to focus. Oh, Jesus. This like this shoot was supposed to be like easier and I'm sweating here already. We are changing into the 100 mil because I'll be able to focus closer on the phone. Oh, let's see. Cool. Yeah, I think the key for those kind of shoots is just to make sure that you have like really nice light because if the light is kind of bad, it's going to be very tough to get any kind of a nice kind of, yeah. When it comes to photo editing, I wanted to make sure that I spice it up somehow with frames or some sort of a collage or something. I did try the collage first. I am not very good at it. So I tried my best, but it was very frustrating and it was very difficult. And then I used an app called Unfold as well on my phone. It's an app that I use for Insta stories. And I found it really cool because it had those vintage photo frames and I thought that it looked so perfect, like a contact sheet. And I love the fact that the images are small so you can't see the quality but it still gives you a gist of the creative photo shoot and that's the whole idea behind it yeah i think we have i think we have something that will work i think there's like a few few cool ones yeah i think let's let's change you maybe let's do the blue next and the blue backdrop so um as you guys see at the moment i'm just taking a mix of phone photos and photos of my phone with the camera. Um, obviously, from a perspective of the quality of the shoot, it's going to be better to have a full file from the Canon because it's a huge file. But at least with the screenshot of FaceTime, at least I have like a better angle and I don't have to mingle with the photo as much because here I just get the skinny shot, which is slightly annoying. Um, 
Um, it's obviously just a photo of a screen, which means that the quality is questionable as well. So, um, but I'm really liking the photos. I love the styling. I love the blue. I think it looks really nice. Um, I think it's a vibe. Okay, I'll take a few more here okay. on FaceTime first. Nice. Beautiful. It's so much easier because Deja is so comfortable with posing and she can see herself as well, which is definitely helpful. So it's like, it's kind of making it a bit easier. We also have a little um, phone stand to help kind of keep it in place, like a phone tripod, beautiful. That's really nice. Yeah, that's mm -hmm. Okay. Can we have one where you're like sitting on your on your shins, kind of just like, ooh, kind of like sideways like that, oh, okay. and just like on your shins, kind of like yeah. Mm. I think it will be pretty okay. nice. Yes. Yeah. 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 Exactly. Can I get the other hand in the shot as well? Just the arm, so it's not... Yeah, perfect. Yes, beautiful. Love that. Cool. Just need to watch my angles because I'm like twisting against the phone because I'm kind of trying to move with Deja, but I keep forgetting that I'm, I'm not moving with you. I'm just moving around the phone. <laughs> Yeah, lovely. Is there any way to like do any standing shots? Hours later. Let's try for a few. Yeah, I don't think the light is like amazing there, but oh well, yeah, we'll see how it works. It looks completely different on the camera, which is very interesting. It kind of looks like a ring of fire, but it's like, I don't know. And can we have a few that are a bit more kind of like, um, like closed eyes, very dreamy, maybe like floaty. If you want to turn the camera so I can show you something like this, kind of like a bit more flowy and just like yeah, exactly. Yeah, it's actually gonna look cool, I think. Yeah. Yeah, I like that. That's cool. That's really nice. Yeah. I think kind of both at the same time, kind of in front of you, that's kind of nice. Yeah, 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 exactly. That's the thing, it just takes so long because it's just like the setup of everything and just like it takes forever. Yeah. And it's just like you know, and it's just like me trying to communicate with you as well, so challenging because like you can't see me properly and it's just like trying to like say like oh move this, move that, and you're like, what? Oh yeah, I love that. Can we do it again? Just for one more shot? Yeah. This one? Yeah, yeah, yeah. This one. And and the one before. <laughs> just do both. Yes. Mm -hmm. It's so interesting. There's so much movement in the shots, even though I'm shooting on 320th of a second, I'm still getting some um, movement. And I think it's because um, I'm taking a photo of a screen and not of the actual model. So it's a bit different. And I think it like reacts differently. So it's very interesting. Okay, I'm back. Okay, I'm sorry, I need to like scream at my dad. He's like rearranging the whole pantry. Oh my god. At this time, at 12 o'clock at night. Can we bring the camera a tiny bit closer to the backdrop? And then I would love to have like some kind of like a, almost like a beauty shot, kind of like something like this. Okay. Kind of like really close up. Yeah, 
What if you like rest it on your on your um, knee if you kind of like sit sit up Almost. and yeah. I mean, yes. Yes, exactly. Beautiful. Okay, I'll take face sign first. Yeah, it's fine. Okay, so for those ones, um, we need to try maybe one or two where you're like relatively still because the minute you're moving your face even a tiny bit, it's just blurry. So let's just try and keep you in like one position for like just the second that I'm taking the photo. Okay, so one, two, three. Okay. Yes, love that. One, two, three. One, two, three. Okay, I think as a bonus shot, we should try to do maybe the, the glove. Like that. Oh, didn't you say you were going to put jewelry on the on the glove? Oh, the ring. Yeah, this is quarantine chic. It's like when you when you want to protect your hands from bacteria, but you also want to look glamorous, so you do this. Can we get the hand somewhere kind of again, kind of in front of the camera so it's kind of the same? Cool. Yeah. Only with this one though or both? Uh, maybe just with the one and the other one. Yeah, the other one kind of like hidden away. So it's like, oh, Jesus. Yeah. Yeah. Lovely. Okay, and let's get you kind of like closer up and just have you like maybe looking down from the glasses. Okay, and mm -hmm. with the gloves. Yeah. And maybe a tiny bit more sideways, so the, the, the glove is kind of more to my, towards me. Oops, Ooh. okay. <laughs> yeah. Can we get the camera even a tiny bit closer to you? Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And maybe, yes, yes, perfect. And just a few kind of like super close-ups, beauty style. Um, so yeah, so let's do a few kind of like quite still and then few kind of maybe like even with like a bit more of a dramatic movement So we okay. get a bit more blur and it's gonna be like a very artsy kind of like image. So Okay, okay so still first mm -hmm. Okay, and let's do the um, the blurry ones, or so you can just like move around freely, basically. Should I scoot back a little bit, or you want to hide? No, no, it's fine. It's just like with your face, you can just like keep moving your face, and there's going to be like oh, nice, okay. and kind of, I, I kind of really like it when you're. It's like when your lips are kind of like a bit more towards the camera. It just like looks really nice. Yeah, yeah. So if you're just like moving around, yeah. Okay. okay. Yeah. Okay. One, two, three, go. Nice. I think that's really cool. I really like those. They're really different. They're not like... Can I see? Yeah. Wait. Wow. Yeah, it is different. Yeah. Okay, guys, that's it for today. Say bye to Deja from our phone. <laughs> we had so much fun. I had I had so much fun. I loved it. Um, Highlight of my quarantine. Yeah, I know, right? It's so different. It's like twelve <laughs> o'clock here. I should be like well asleep at this point, but it's just it, it was a lot of fun. I have to say, it was very different. There was definitely a lot of challenges. It took us a long time. It took us almost like three hours, which is yeah. pretty much what normal photo shoot would take. But yeah. I guess because you have to do everything yourself, it's kind of a tricky situation. So um, thank you so much for joining me for this quarantine photo shoot. I'm so excited. Um, we were saying that we are gonna recreate the shots once we are out of quarantine and I'm actually in LA and we can actually redo it properly and then see how it works. So stay tuned for that. Make sure to check out Deja. I'm going to link her down below. And if you did like this video, please make sure to give me a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel and I will see you guys next time.